Welcome to this episode today. Uh, I'm leaving a hotel to get out and see the world, find something to do. Not quite sure what. So while I uh, while I do that, roll the intro. Alright, so while it's my day off today, I, uh, it, you know, I'm taking today off, not tomorrow off. Tomorrow I'm working, so I'm taking today off. While I'm taking... Really? While I'm taking today off, I decided to come... Let me show you. I decided to come here. Do you guys know what this is? This is Thomas Edison's factory right here. So, so I decided to come here for my day off. Hopefully I can bring the camera in and film a little bit. It's kind of interesting. I kind of wanted to go here for a little bit and haven't had the chance. Today I do. Alright. Alright, we're going in. Here we go. I don't need to worry about that. Whoa. Should I get the team to start punching in and out on those things? I could find one, right? That's a cool staircase. I like that. I like tall ceilings. I think that's my favorite part so far. Whoa, what's this? I'm kind of just like figuring that as I go along. Don't like do the tours. I'm weird like that. Why oh, do you like the... What do you use as filaments? I don't know. blueprints made it back from the Tom Edison factory museum thing really interesting really cool um, at the end there I just wanted to walk around and experience like the music stuff so I didn't film as much um, gonna head back up to the room do some do some work on the, on the some client work and stuff, so it's not as exciting as vlog. I'll I'll, I'll 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 see you in a little bit though. All right, so finished some work, but I went to CVS. Sorry, right, gotta get some batteries. So check this out. All right, so I got my batteries, and then this is this is the receipt. I literally got one. What the. I literally got one thing of batteries, and this, this is the receipt. I got this, and they gave me, I mean, all, like, that's, this is way 
too much receipt for too little of a thing. All right, now it's time to transform into my tech self. So, time to take a shower. Time to get dressed in all black. Change the hat. Did I? I'll tell you while I. I have to share still why. I still have to share why or how Mark and I met. Um, and that whole that whole thing. I also want to kind of share um, why I wear that one hat always when I do tech. Let me get ready. Ah. Uh. Alrighty, well, so I'm in my all black, I got my, my hat on, um, so let me start with the hat and then I'll get into like how Mark and I met. Um, so basically the hat I, I got at the Dave Matthews concert, if you didn't know, uh, the Dave Matthews band is the reason I kind of started music, I started listening to them since I was like two and then kind of just fell in love with music after I saw a DVD of theirs, um, so that's the reason I'm kind of in music and it's a little homage to like them and kind of where my music career started and it's also, it's black, so it worked as well, but the main reason is because it's a little homage to them and um, if you didn't know, if you guys follow um, uh, the Carter Beaufort fan page, which is their drummer, um, their fan page, or a lot of the Dave Matthews fan groups on, on, on Instagram, I help a lot when they do like Tech Tuesdays and tech articles and stuff, I'm writing and helping a, a lot with those because I, I know their tech um, really, really well. Um, some of their tech guys know me um, just from me writing these articles and they read them a little bit, so um, that, that's kind of nice and kind of cool. So that's that's the reason um, f for the hat, it's a little, uh, it's more like my lucky hat. Um, so anyways, um, how Mark and I met is Mark and I, well M Mark used to play at a, at a, in a band that I used to do sound at, it was like the first band I was really like involved with. Um, as a tech guy, so I was. Um, he came in. It was an old drummer, so so that drummer moved, and Mark came in to kind of replace replace that drummer. And um, he came in. I just kind of instinctively started to help set up his kit, and we got started talking. Yes, I'm a drummer. I'm a drummer, but like I'm a drummer too. And you know, we got started talking about equipment and gear and drums we like, and just a little like geeking out kind of. And then um, another band member actually, he was um, he would fill in for guitar every now and then, and then he was kind of like the main tech guy, um, the, you know, the stage manager and production manager. He kind of brought up like, hey, what do you think of if you would want a drum tech for Mark? Um, and I was a little like, I don't know, um, I was a little iffy about it, and then, you know, him, Mark and I kind of sat down and talked about it, and we realized it's what I probably should do. So I started teching for him with that band and then when he started to go do a lot of other gigs and other bands it was nice for him to have a tech guy so he doesn't have to worry about the equipment at all. Um, so I kind of just jumped along and then it just kind of built to where it is today where like we have this like unneeded words, we don't really need the words to communicate with each other throughout a night. Um, a lot of eye signals. Um, I'm kind of reading his mind as the night goes, um, making sure. I mean, he texts for himself a lot. I mean, you probably saw in some um, clips from yesterday's episode, he's fixing symbols as he's playing, which I let him do. Um, I'm not, you know, it's not taking my job away, but um, I let him do it unless something like, you know, he dropped a stick last night. I I replaced it and picked it up for him, um, and uh, you know, and, and there's some issues last night with the kick pedal, so I. I got fish down in there and got it uh, working again and um, it's just amazing what he can do on how he can accommodate um, the fixes I'm making and, and me working around him and he just doesn't miss a beat he's an amazing drummer um, and like one of the reasons one of the I mean there's a lot of tech guys I look up to one of the, I mean, my favorite drum tech of all time is Dave Matthews drum tech and he's also their stage manager uh, Henry Lonetsky. Um just an amazing drum tech really knows a lot he's been with them since the start of the band and I've been kind of with Mark um, for for a bunch of other kind of starts and new new things, um, and and kind of helped fill in some some other gaps as well. So um, Mark's like family to me. Um, it's just great to have that that connection and that job with him. So um, that's a little bit how we met. That's a little bit on um, what I'm doing now as a drum tech with him. Um, if you didn't know, West 35 Media actually does all his. Um, we help with his social media and his website and stuff like that. So. Um, you know, I bring I can bring a camera along and just shoot stuff for my for the vlog and also for his website at the same time. So that's what I was doing last night at, at, while drum teching. Um, so tonight's the same thing, just night two. Um, so I gotta run off to night two. 
All right, night two. Here we go. Made it. Time to get ready. Nobody on my mind sometimes I wish I had you, but I don't That's fine, so I guess it's okay Yeah, I guess it's okay I ain't got nobody on my mind sometimes I wish I had you, but I don't That's fine, so I guess it's okay Yeah, I guess it's okay Yeah, I woke up this morning super happy Gotta get my caffeine and catch up with my homies Cause we are growing up so fast Don't waste time doing things that never will last Stop it Alright, so night two is officially done I need to pack up the uh, the room tonight because I'm checking out Cause I'm checking out tomorrow um, So I need to get the car ready to go because to leave early but I want to sleep in so I'm gonna get all the the moving and stuff done tonight so so I can just sleep in a little bit tomorrow because I think checkouts 10 30 or 11 something like that all right let's get in let's get to the hotel room I'll do a time lapse of me uh, tearing down the guitar rig and set up and stuff like that ready time lapse been running faster than ever towards all of my dreams Leaving work at 5 o'clock, been making these beats I hope you notice, you just need to focus Life gets wavy when you just own it Own it, own it When you just, when you just Own it, own it When you just, when you just I ain't got nobody on my mind sometimes I wish I had you, but I don't That's fine, so I guess it's okay Yeah, I guess it's okay I ain't got nobody on my mind sometimes. Alrighty, so the room's basically packed I'm doing everything else tomorrow night So thank you guys for watching this episode I'll see you tomorrow Peace I see my reflection, I know I'm not perfect, but I have direction to follow God's lead.